You know who else is getting checks? Oh. Barack Obama. Let's talk about it. Mm-hmm. Let's talk about mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. So, you know, we talked about this, like, you know, several weeks ago when we said, you know, he was getting $60 million for his memoir, right? So now... Everybody is coming for his edges because I'm they found out my edges now. Uh, this, can, no. can you get another? No, okay, no. sorry. Just like is it colloquialism. <laughs> what is it? Colloquial? I can't say it. No, that's what. What is it? <laughs> Who's the guy that you keep talking about? Ray Ray. When you get rid of I, Ray Ray, I'm so finished with Ray Ray. When at you this get rid point, of Ray Ray, I, I'll get I'm rid of the edges. At this, I'm gonna do is who oh I'm doing. Oh my god, I'm gonna do. Anyway, <laughs> so President Barack Obama has been getting a lot of flack because he just gave a four hundred thousand dollar speech to some execs some wall street execs and As he some should. people were like why how dare he do that because he's harvard educated so Cause he but nobody said anything about uh, bill clinton when he was getting all that money he got about that much to to do mm-hmm. all those speaking engagements and his mm-hmm. book and so why so so the black man can't get no money i mean everybody's getting a lot of money i mean there were a lot <laughs> That's of a lot of money to be had right i'm saying well well, well, well maybe maybe Barack Obama will start a foundation and start funneling some of that money at least to Chicago, to the hood. Well, okay, so this that is an argument. You can change the hood. Listen, this is an argument. So I personally did not think that it was an issue because, like you said, many presidents have done it. It's mm-hmm. become a thing. But some people were saying, look, you know, Barack Obama did not come against Wall Street as hard as people thought he should have in the wake of the recession. Oh, and so they're like, wait a minute, now you're actually you know, benefiting from them. So no wonder no one ever goes after Wall Street because they know they can dangle that money, you know, after you're done. He spoke at a Wall Street thing. Now, come on, that does not mean that he is, no. But but that's what they're saying, though. But remember, who the consumer is is who the consumer is because if if Mm -hmm. Harvard University asks him to speak at at his price, is his price at this point, they're not saying, oh, come, we'll give you this money. Maybe he's setting a price. Like, the thing is, he took the, he took the money and he didn't come down hard enough. So that's the Bernie Sanders, that's the, the Elizabeth Warren argument about, wait a minute, we are too, our politicians and our ex-politicians are too much in the pockets of Wall Street and that's why we can't get any substantive reform. So what should so we do? So what should we do? We I, shouldn't I, get paid? I believe. Tell me how to do it. Well, you know, I don't, I don't know how to do it. I'm not a politician. I'm no, just I mean, just tell, just tell me how to do it, right? <laughs> just, t- just tell me how to do it because the they do is, a job, they leave the job. Yeah, yeah. Now, now all for, for so, into perpetuity they're supposed to just like live by this kind of model standard that who is setting for them like get <laughs> foh <laughs> foh go ahead boy no, put I'm your a, listen i was if it was jay-z that. that got 400 million dollars guess what it'd be okay well i mean well listen okay there was a thing there was a little line that he said in in what is it dreams of my father 2006 is oh the audacity of hope and he was talking about when you're that close to money Money starts corrupting you. That's what Obama wrote back in 2006. But guess what? And but I guess like, what? Mm, how much? Four hundred million dollars. Four hundred thousand. Four hundred thousand. Oh, Four hundred thousand dollars. Four hundred yeah. million dollars. For it's not a lot of money. Right. You know what I'm trying to say? Mm-hmm. It's not corruptible money. He, he's going to get an invoice. He's going to pay some taxes on it. Like it's not corruptible money. It's not billions of dollars. It's not what Halliburton did. Right. You know what I'm trying to say? It's not like like what um. What's our old mayor? The the you, um, Bloomberg. Bl- mayor Bloomberg. Like like how he his company went from five billion to like twenty something billion after he left. He wouldn't take a check. Right, you didn't need to check a check because you got a whole bunch of contracts. I'm just saying. No, I mean, but this is the system that we're in. You know, you're right, gonna so, make so money when you come out. So so so, so us, black people, mm. uh, minorities, not just black people, we're not supposed to engage in that kind of commerce because why? Why exactly? We've been we have not been invited to the party. So so no. When you, that's what you're, the argument that you're making is the same argument that people have made online. Hey, wait a minute. No one said anything when all of these other white presidents were saying some doing the same thing, okay. and now all of a sudden we're coming for Barack Obama. So they F- dismissed it. O-H. So H. All Get right. Get your so. coins up, Barack. Michelle, she could wear them little kitten heels now. She Louboutin. Ken Hills, because she wouldn't do it before. You sh- I was like, where's your, where's your lose, Michelle? Oh, she my gosh. Do it. She wouldn't do it. Mm. Listen, all right. Mm. Go for rock. Okay.